So in this video, we're going to go over a few basic troubleshooting steps you can take, just some common fixes to some common problems. First thing we're going to talk about is internet connectivity. If you notice up here, the little globe icon is gray, and every once in a while it blinks green. That's indicative that we are getting internet and that everything's okay. If you ever see this turning red, that means that there's some issue with your internet. You're going to need to see if you can figure out what's going on, if this is something that happens all the time. First thing to do is to check your internet settings on your iPad. To find those settings, just hit the home button and go into your settings. It looks like this. It might be in a different place, you know, on one of these screens, but I've got mine down here at the bottom. And you want to check up here. We recommend either using Wi-Fi or cellular data, but not both. So whichever one you're using, you want to turn the other one off. Once you've done that, just tap the refresh button up here. If you've done that and you're still having issues, you might want to check your internet with a speed test to make sure that it's not running really slowly. I have the speed test app already installed, and there's several of them that you can use. You just want to check and make sure that it's not really slow. 100 megabits per second, that's pretty good. If you have continued connectivity issues, you might want to bring them up with either your network administrator or if you're using cellular data with your cell provider. The next issue is for devices that have credit card and laser scanners. If you don't have those attached, then this is not going to be applicable. You see these two icons up here, one's for the barcode and the other one is for the credit card scanner. If you have a scanner connected, but there's no logos up there, that means you have some kind of connectivity issue. Your iPad's not seeing that device. Check the battery life of the scanner. On the Linea Pro scanner, which is for the iPhones, there's a little button on the back you can push to check the battery life. If the battery life's looking okay, you can perform a soft reset. You hold that battery button down and then hold the laser button until it beeps. Then you come back into the app and you refresh it and see if that does the trick. If you're having any kind of charging battery issues with these scanners, there's a few things you can check. You want to make sure that the charging plug you're using is a 2.1 amp. Some of the most common chargers are not 2.1 amp, they're 1 amp. So you want to use anything 2.1 or higher. And that number is found right here. Every charger is going to have this somewhere, so you're just going to have to look around and find it. You should also check and make sure that fast charging is enabled in the Flash Valet app. You can go to Control, Settings, it's down here at the very bottom, and then Fast Charging, that checkbox right there. Make sure that's checked. Then you should check the AMP settings in the IPC app. So I'm going to hit Home. We're going to launch this IPC Support app right here. And it's here in the Configuration tab. It's probably going to pop up looking like this, but you go over to the Configuration tab. It should say 2.1 amps right there. If you have any further issues, you can try updating your firmware and updating your iOS or updating the Flash Valet app. 